listening. Hey y'all, it's Cameron the Can Country Guys with another. No. It's not a what we did video, y'all. It's just a regular hair video. Hey y'all, it's Cameron the Can to come to you guys with a new video. So this video is gonna be about this hair that I have on my head. Y'all, these curls are popping. Like this by far is in my top three favorite like curl patterns. Like I really am enjoying this curl pattern a lot. I did brush it out. Cause I like the bigger look right now. I'm going through this phase where I'm really liking big hair. But besides that, y'all, I'm enjoying these curls. But let me tell y'all where I got it from. So I was sent this hair by Kara, Natural Virgin Hair. So the unit I have on my head is, I'm reading over here on my laptop, but I have their 22 inch 360 loose wave lace wig. Like small wand curls already made in the unit. Like I just am really enjoying this unit, y'all. Like I haven't done anything to this unit. Y'all, no styling. It looks like perfect wand curls. I love that. I just love the way this looks. Oh, I love it. I really want to dye it. And I'm thinking about dyeing it like a, I don't know, like maybe like a burgundy color on the ends. What do you guys think? Because I haven't dyed hair in a really long time. I've been doing just kind of like quick review videos, but I really want to do some dye some hair. I really want to dye some hair. So what do you guys think? I'm thinking burgundy on the ends. I always do like a, you know, like a blonde color, but I'm thinking like a burgundy on the ends. I think that would be really nice. I actually saw Jayla Corian do it to her hair and it looked so good. I was like, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna go ahead and insert a clip of me unboxing the wig as well as me um styling it. I barely styled it. I really just like, you know, sometimes you feel like laying your baby hairs down and then other days you feel like, I don't really feel like doing it. Today is I don't feel like doing it today. So I kind of just, uh, yeah, I didn't do nothing to my edges. So if I laid them down, Y'all know it would be looking like, you know, them Instagram slang slaughter game photos. But we're going to just work with the non-laying the edges down. Because some people don't do it and I think it still looks good. Like, I think I think the wig still looks good. Especially because it's, like, curly. So it's easier to blend. Let me start running my mouth and let's get to the clip. Hey, y'all. So here's the packaging. Super, super cute. It's very basic, but I do like that they at least had their name on the box. So on the inside, they gave me some false lashes and a wig cap. Actually, it was two wig caps in one, which is cool. Then gave me like this paper with information on the hair, how to take care of it, how to do refunds and all that, which is important, y'all, because if you do have a wig you don't like, don't be afraid to reach out to the company and send it back. So on the little packaging that um, the hair, the actual unit was in, it had like the information on the length of the hair, the type and all that. So this is what the unit looks like, and it is a 360, so there is lace all the way around the unit. There's a comb in the middle, two combs on the side, as well as a comb on the bottom. And adjustable straps as well. I am going to cut that lace off. I do show you a little bit. This is what the hairline looks like with the lace on. So I wasn't planning on showing you guys, but I was like, let me just go ahead and cut it on camera while I'm here. So I basically, I'm just following the hairline. That's pretty much what I do with every single unit. Following it, try not to make a really, really, really straight line because nobody's hairline is straight. So you want to make sure it's kind of like following your own personal hairline. But I most likely, most of the time, I just um, follow the hairline of the unit that it creates. But sometimes I do cut a little bit more of the lace. Or leave a bit more. It just kind of depends on the unit. So as you see, I'm just cutting all the way around because there's lace all the way around. Be very, very care careful that you don't cut the um, adjustable strap or anything like that. But here, as you see, I got some of the hair on there. But it'd be I, e b i, e b i. So here, I'm just kind of pulling the hair gently. Just kind of get rid of some of that excess hair that I um, I um, cut off accidentally. So it's quite a bit, but that wasn't shedding y'all that wasn't shedding that was for me uh you know cutting the unit so here i'm just throwing the unit on my head boom like that oh killing with the sledge a so <laughs> okay let me stop so here as you see the flaps on the side i'm gonna show you in a second they're up a perfect way to get rid of that you guys instead of using glue or tape or anything like that get an elastic band you guys but i was being lazy didn't like sewing it on so here i'm just gonna bobby pin it and kind of turn it under and then bobby pin it so you can't see that light colored lace on the sides Super helpful, super quick when you just don't feel like sewing that elastic band, but I am 100% elastic band girl. So, <laughs> definitely get that, um, definitely do that instead. Here, like I said, I'm just giving you an alternative method if you just have like, being lazy like me. Here, I'm lightly pulling out a little bit of baby hair, but then I was like, you know what, I don't even feel like laying them down, so it'll be all right. Here, I'm just showing you the parting. Very, very good parting, easy to part, but y'all know I love my curly units, just to flip them over. So, in the front, I'm going into my Maybelline Nudes palette, my eyeshadow palette, and I'm going to add a little bit of that black around the perimeter, just to kind of conceal that um, the lace a little bit more because the lace was pretty light. I don't bleach my knots or anything like that. Um, I might try that one of these days, but yeah, I just didn't. So here I'm just kind of playing around with the unit to see how I like it, what I want to do with it. I'm showing you guys the curls. Super gorgeous curls, you guys. It's so soft. I have no problems with the unit, but yeah, that's it. That's pretty much all I did for styling with this unit. Super quick, easy, basic, simple, but 
Yes. Ooh, what y'all think? I really, I'm just really like, I wasn't expecting the loose, I don't know, like when they say loose curl, I wasn't expecting to be like this, but I really, 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 really like it. Like, I like this a lot. Ooh, it seems so much longer than 22 inches. I'm gonna go ahead and do a spin around so you guys can see the back, but I swear this seems a lot longer than 22. Let me show y'all. It really goes like down to my butt which I swear like I'm 5'7 so I really feel like it's a lot longer than 22 inches so that's a plus because um then I can cut it a little bit however short I want it or whatever but I really am liking the long length especially for like you know the summer y'all curls okay so yeah like I said it is human hair so of course you can dye it like I said I want to dye it you can straighten it you can pretty much do whatever you would to your with your real hair that you would do to this unit so really really cute you guys I just keep running my fingers through it as you see I'm not getting any tangles Shedding, I did get a little bit of shedding, and I'm still getting maybe like a few strands here and there. Like, there's one strand. I don't know if you guys can see that. But, um, shedding is minimum. Tangles are literally none. I'm not getting any, so that's a plus. Let me do this side for something. Like, you need to do this side. This will be super cute short. So, I'm going to keep it long and dye it, and then probably cut it a little bit shorter. Or, I might cut it shorter than dye it. I don't know. I just really like the curl pattern. So, like, I think it would be really cute if it was, like, short, you know? Cause it's really long. Let me show you guys in the front. It's like, it's like down to my hips. See that? Stretched out. This way is curly. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. I just came kind of like a show and tell kind of thing. Give you guys a little mini review, but um, I am gonna. I do want to go back and like uh, re-review -re some of my other units from other companies and dye it and style it and things like that. So don't worry, it's coming up. It's coming. Up. I'm about to slow down on receiving units and start you know going back and re-reviewing some other units just so i can give you guys updates i get a lot of questions on updates so don't worry i read your comments i hear you guys i'm working on it i'm working on it just stay pa just stay patient with me and stay tuned to some other videos you guys always leave me some video requests down in the comment section below i always read those thank you again to kara wigs for sending me this gorgeous unit i really 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 love this curl pattern you guys i love this curl pattern if y'all know a synthetic wig that has this curl pattern hook your girl up or if y'all know any other uh, companies that sell this curl pattern let me know because i am in love with this like in love with this curl pattern but don't forget to thumbs up this video if you enjoyed also leave me some comments down below like i said don't forget to share this video with your family and friends and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next video love you guys later